Hello and welcome to the YouTube channel D Creations Resources. We are looking at multiple choice questions from physics as well as maths. Currently we are looking at questions from nuclear physics pertaining to the phenomena like the phenomenon of radioactivity. We have already tackled some questions about radioactivity. Today let us tackle one more question. The question is in natural radioactive decay which of the following emissions has highest penetration power and the options given are a alpha particles b beta particles and c gamma rays now if you recall we have done an episode about ionization power and we had seen that amongst these three alpha particles have the highest ionization power because of its because of their mass now for penetration power it's opposite what exactly is penetration power penetration power is basically the ability of radiation to pass through matter now try to imagine two places a place where it's an empty space and a place where there is a crowd say a train station where will the penetration be difficult? Well, the penetration will be difficult in the crowded sta station. So, for example, when you have a massive object with mass as well as very high density, then in that case, the penetration is going to be difficult. So, in this case also, we find that if you want to, if you do not want the radiation to penetrate, the gamma radiation, because Amongst these three, gamma rays have highest penetration power. Inversely proportional to mass is how we talk about penetration power. And even for gamma rays, uh, say a paper is not sufficient to block it completely, whereas alpha particles can be blocked by that. Wood is not sufficient to block gamma rays. Alpha particles as well as beta particles would be blocked say by a thick piece of wood but for gamma rays you require thick lead sheets which as I said lead has very high density and I gave the analogy of a crowded train station where there are so many people and you wouldn't be able to pass through or penetrate easily. So, here the idea was not just to solve the question but also try to understand what is penetration power and you can relate it see alpha particles when they interact with matter they can even get neutralized so gamma rays in that sense are most dangerous because they have very high penetration power even in the nuclear explosions in when or even when atomic bomb was dropped on hiroshima and nagasaki it's these gamma rays which really created havoc. So now we know that amongst the three radiations, alpha particles, beta particles and gamma rays, alpha particles have the highest ionization power but the highest penetration power is possessed by gamma rays. Thank you.